There's no better time to find these tremendous Mazda savings than right now at Team Mazda. Get 0% financing on any new Mazda CX-5, Mazda CX-30, Mazda CX-50, or the Mazda CX-90. Find out just how much you can save at Team Mazda on Airline. Good afternoon, everyone, and thank you for joining us for 9 News Now. I'm T. Powell. Baton Rouge police are investigating a deadly crash involving a motorcyclist. Police say the victim, 26-year-old Logan Oob, was riding his motorcycle on South Boulevard near Nicholson around 945 Monday night. According to officials, he was hit by another vehicle, and he and a passenger were both ejected during the crash. Oob died at the scene. The passenger was taken to the hospital with injuries that are not life-threatening. This is an ongoing investigation. The Ascension Parish Sheriff's Office says deputies are searching for the driver of a truck allegedly involved in a hit and run crash. The crash reportedly happened at the intersection of Highway 261 and Highway 44 in Gonzales on September 14th around 930 p.m. According to law enforcement, detectives are asking for information about the red truck, possibly a Nissan Titan that you see there on your screen. The driver of the vehicle is suspected to be involved in the crash. If you have any information that can help, you're encouraged to call Crime Stoppers. That number is 344-STOP. The Zachary Police Department is asking for your help to identify the person on your screen right now. He is behind the purchase of a $7,000 lawnmower stolen with a, used with a stolen credit card. If you recognize them, you can contact Zachary PD by calling the number on your screen. That's 225-654-1921. And now to a 9 News alert, the town of Slaughter is under a boil water advisory. Town officials say that it's due to a treatment equipment failure. That advisory will continue until further notice. We'll update you as soon as we hear more. Just ahead, a check of your evening forecast. Don't go anywhere. And let's take a look now at the Sky 9 camera. A beautiful day, warm, but will we see some rain in the coming days? Let's get to Henry Blake's for that, Henry. It looks like the rain will be returning before you know it, but at least for the rest of your Wednesday into at least the first half of Thursday, we're looking dry and practically cloud free, but it is a bit on the hot side. You'll notice already in the 90s for not only Baton Rouge, but Gonzalez as well. But when you factor in what it feels like, many of us, it feels like at least the low to mid 90s out there. The 90s extend into the Sunshine State and notice a lot of that heat extending into the Northern Plains. So it's not just us here across the Gulf Coast states experiencing those above normal temperatures, but majority of us in the lower 48 states are at least above normal with record highs being set in the Northern Plains as they reach the 90s as well. But large ridge of high pressure keeping much of the nation on the dry side. But look at this in the tropics. We've got a little bit of development trying to go underway that could bring us some rain chances as we go later on into the work week. But for your evening forecast, looking great. Not expecting any precipitation temperatures, lowering it to the 80s. And then after sunset, we should be at least in the 70s for many of us for our morning lows with a few 60s out there. A couple of disturbances. The big one, Hurricane Kirk. That is going to remain out at sea. We also have right behind it, Tropical Depression number 13. However, in the Gulf and the Caribbean, we are going to be looking out for some potentially rapid development across the region. Now that could bring us, as mentioned, those chances for a few hit or miss showers the second half of tomorrow. But looking at rather dry conditions um, for at least the next 24 hours elsewhere as I mentioned Kirk and the tropical depression for now remaining out at sea but watch as our rain chances gradually increase not much of anything for tonight let alone tomorrow morning but notice during the afternoon start to see um, some cloud cover increase as well as some slight rain chances but we do have better chances of rain coming in for your Friday as that disturbance tries to pull in some of that moisture to the Gulf Coast states afterwards 
we do look forward to at least nicer weather for next week, especially. All right, thank you for joining us for Nine News Now and join us again in 25 minutes for Nine News at Four. It's time to gear up for game day at Team Toyota. Right now, get a new 24 Tacoma for just $269 a month or get 2.99% financing for 72 months on a new Toyota Tundra. Score thousands in savings on your new Toyota from Team Toyota. I-12 at O'Neill.